All right, my love, let's see what we have here for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Holy Spirit, angel spirits and guides, what clarity and guidance? What love messages do we have here for Pisces, please? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs for Pisces, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for Pisces, please. Spirit, clarity, guidance, love messages. Okay. So we have the Seven of Pentacles in the reverse, and we have the Seven of Swords in the reverse. Clarity, guidance, and love messages for my Pisces. Three of Swords in the reverse, and the Three of Cups in the reverse. Clarity, guidance, and love messages for my Pisces. So we've got the Knight of Pentacles, and we've got the Five of Cups. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Energy. We've got the High Priestess in the reverse, Cancer Piscean energy, and the Ten of Cups in the reverse. Messages for my Pisces, please, Spirit. So we have the Wheel of Fortune in the reverse, and we have the Six of Pentacles. Clarity, Guidance, Love Messages for my Pisces. So we've got the King of Pentacles and the Knight of Swords, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra energy here, and more Earth energy. Under the deck, we've got the Ace of Wands. So Pisces. In the recent past, or coming into the near future, depending on, you know, time isn't linear, so you take it as it resonates. Pisces, I feel like someone here made the decision to stop investing in something. Someone here made a very clear decision of I'm getting the heck out of here. Okay. I don't want to reconcile either Pisces. You didn't want to be in a third party situation or you did not want to come back together with this person. All right. Because three of cups, three of swords in the reverse. Um, maybe you, you found out that you were in a third party situation and you did not want that. Or, you know, for others of you, it could just be, I don't want to reconcile with you because I don't, I just want to heal and I want to move on with my life. So something here got left behind. You've chosen with the seven of pentacles in the reverse to, to not look back. You've chosen to not invest in this connection whatsoever. Now, with the Knight of Pentacles and the Five of Cups here, what we have is an apology coming in from someone that does feel remorseful, does feel regretful. Um, the problem here is, Pisces, is that they took, no, A, they took too long to come forward with this apology. And number two, the truth is already out. With the High Priestess in the reverse, you already, there's no mystery here. With the Ten of Cups in the reverse, you already have your mind set on the fact that this person doesn't love you. Do you see what I'm saying? You're, you're just not, um, there's no question for you anymore. There's no mystery here. You already know that this person has no feelings for you. I don't know what this person did to you in the past, but whatever they did to you, Pisces, showed you 100%, okay, you don't love me. Like, that's the type of energy I'm feeling here. I don't know if they put you in a third party. I don't know what they did to hurt you. But this person did something where there's there's no shadow of a doubt in your mind that this person doesn't love you. Okay? And they're coming in with this apology, this regret, this remorse. You just don't care. Because you're like, I know the truth. I'm, I, I, there's just not a doubt in my mind. You don't love me. With the Wheel of Fortune in the reverse and the Six of Pentacles, I feel like this person blocked their own blessing. You may have been very generous with this person financially. You maybe were just there for them a lot. There's no, there was no, there was one person here that was giving more than the other. And I feel like you were giving to this Knight of Pentacles, but they blocked their own blessing. Whatever this person did, they blocked their own blessing. So now they're going to come rushing in, Pisces. They're going to come rushing in saying, listen, okay, I'm not going to be the Knight of Pentacles anymore. I'm willing to change to the King of Pentacles because this person is realizing that they lost the abundance that you were giving to them. Again, this could have been money, time, attention, affection, whatever it is, you were giving this person something and you were very generous with it, even if it was just love, kindness, whatever, you know, and this person's realizing that they have nothing without you. And I mean nothing, but... 
as I said, one person was giving a lot, the other person was getting nothing. This person, and I feel like it was one particular event, it could have been something they said, something they did, where you just have it dead set in your heart, Pisces, that this person doesn't love you. That's it. And, and you're just, yeah, I, I don't really feel like you're going to be able to see this person in any other light. But they're rushing in to offer that commitment. Clarity, guidance, love messages. But they're not rushing in to offer the commitment out of love. They're coming in to offer the commitment because they blocked their blessing. They blocked whatever they were getting from you by, by doing what they did and losing you. Seven of swords in the reverse, please, for Pisces. The Justice card, Libra Energy. So Pisces, whatever this person did, you walking away from them or leaving them for dead the way you did, like you just totally shut the door on somebody, you were justified in doing so. That's them reaping the karma that they sowed. Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. We've got, yeah, you, you, you've lost passion for this. Knight of Wands in the reverse. You don't want to be with a player. You don't want to, whatever it is, you just have no passion, no desire whatsoever to invest in this connection. Three of Cups in the reverse. Queen of Cups in the reverse. Piscean energy. I feel like you see this person as emotionally manipulative or you have fallen out of love with this person. You just don't care anymore. Three of Swords in the reverse. And the Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. Pisces, you're in this energy where, like, listen, I'm good. You know, <laughs> you know, Pisces, you're in this energy of, listen, I got my pentacles. Like, the Queen of Pentacles is one of the queens that really stands on their own financially. Like, this could be a, as a representation of, like, a single parent. Whatever it is, is someone very independent. The Queen of Pentacles is very independent, can stand on her own two feet or his own two feet. We don't read gender in tarot. But with the Three of Swords energy, this is someone that's saying, listen, I'm going to heal. I'm so I'm fine. I don't need nothing. Goodbye. You know, Knight of Pentacles energy, please. Five of Wands in the reverse. Tell me about the Five of Cups and the Nine of Swords in the reverse. So let me just tell you something here, Pisces, okay? This person's coming towards you with this energy of regret, but they don't care. Like, how can I... Like, the, with the Five of Wands in the reverse, you're not going to get, like, a huge fight out of them. The Nine of Swords in the reverse, they're not losing sleep over this. They're coming in with this half ass apology, saying how they feel bad or whatever. And, you know, it's just so clear to you that this person just doesn't care. Tell me about the High Priestess and the reverse we've got the three of swords and we've got the ace of cups i feel like this person met someone new uh, uh, pisces i feel that maybe you were married to this person and they started talking to somebody new that's possible but you know that there's a third party in the picture you you know that there's a third party in the picture and uh, you found something out here you found out something a secret came out with that high priestess in the reverse that broke your heart. And I feel like it has to do with them talking to someone new. Tell me about the ten of cups in the reverse and the four of wands. This person was not with you for love, Pisces. They were with you for the stability that you offered, whether it was a place to live or whatever. You were just like their rock. So they were with you for the stability. Tell me about the wheel of fortune in the reverse. Five of Swords in the reverse. This person has such a stagnant energy. Such a stagnant energy. They didn't want to fight for their blessing. They didn't want to put any work into the blessing that was given to them. And that's why it stalled out with the Wheel of Fortune in the reverse. Six of Pentacles. Temperance in the reverse, Sagittarian energy. You were tired of forgiving somebody here, Pisces. You know, you kept on reconciling with this person. They would come in with an apology. You would reconcile. Apology, reconcile. Page of Cups and the Three of Cups. You're tired. You don't want to reconcile anymore. You don't want to forgive this person. You don't want to. You just don't want to. <laughs> like, I just don't want to, you know. King of Pentacles, please. And the Queen of Wands in the reverse. So I feel like this person is coming in saying, listen, I'll be your King of Pentacles. I'll be solid. I'll be stable. We've got the King to the Queen of Pentacles on the board, a true pair. But with the Queen of Wands in the reverse, this is the Queen of Wands in the reverse um, is an energy of getting attention any way that you can, wanting to win. 
wanting to but it's also a very selfish controlling energy okay and i feel like this person's coming in making this offer to commit to you pisces but it's not coming from a healthy place it's coming from someone who is just going to say whatever they need to say to get back into your good graces tell me about the knight of swords this is a fast talker yes he's six of wands you see they just want to win they just want to win because they want to get back whatever it is that you are giving to them but I feel like you're going to stand your ground here, Pisces, honestly. I feel like you're going to stand your ground. And with that Ten of Swords energy, I don't feel like you're going to let this person back in because you have taken... Whatever this person did, it's almost like a light bulb went off. Like, that's the type of feeling that I'm getting. Like, you find out something here about this person. Something is said or done. You may have found out that they were talking to someone new. Um, you may have already started speaking to someone new. But I feel like, Pisces, this person did or said something. And it just shut you off just like a light bulb seriously what do you need to release and a win-win outcome is in the forecast um so i feel like pisces the way you see it at is i'm gonna release this i win because i'm getting away from someone who doesn't care about me and you win because now you can go and be free to go do whatever you want to do because i know you don't love me so there's no reason for you to even be in this connection do you understand i feel like you the way you see it is is that you know the scales are balancing out everybody gets what they deserve i'm releasing this i'm letting it go i don't see you going back here pisces i gotta be honest indecision an angel of balance Maybe there was a point in time here, Pisces. Maybe this was a third-party energy and you were waiting for this person to choose you. Like, who do you value more? Maybe you were patient for a long time. This could be an energy that it could be that, you know, it could be that this was a third-party situation, Pisces, and you waited a long time for someone to choose you and you just got tired. Um, or it could be that, you know, you have spent a long time trying to decide whether you should stay or go and you've decided to value yourself and put yourself first. Spirit, what messages do we have here for my Pisces, please? Clarity, guidance, love messages for my Pisces. We've got angels of the four directions and we've got courage. So your guides are giving you the courage to do this, Pisces. Your guides, your highest guides, your, your archangels are giving you the courage to actually see this for what it is and just move on. You're not even thinking about this person. So we've got cassette in the reverse. Um, outdated thinking, conditioning, replaying events over in your head. You're, you're not even thinking about them. You're, you're, something here shuts you off like a light bulb, like a light bulb, Pisces. Yeah, you're ascending. Transcending obstacles, learning, expansion, new phase, preparing for union. Yeah, you've learned your lesson here. You've learned your lesson. You're shutting this out. You're ascending spiritually, and you're preparing for a new phase in your life. Tell me about Pisces, please. Romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. It's safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all and wedding so pisces it says here ascending preparing for union i feel like you're going to meet someone new pisces i feel like you're going to meet someone new um i feel like you're going to have feelings for this person quickly honestly but it's safe you're going to find someone here who's safe this is possibly possibly going to be someone that you marry okay so pisces is going to get better okay i love you guys bye